Hey guys, welcome back to video number 30. In the last few videos, we learned what loops were. And don't be discouraged if you don't fully understand how loops work yet, because you will as time goes on. It's really hard to watch just one video and understand thoroughly how something works. But trust me, stick with me, and you guys will be able to distinguish through all the three loops and know when how to use them in due time. So in this video, I want to talk about the PHP statement called continue. And we use continue when we want to skip through an element in a loop, but continue throughout that loop. So let's go ahead and create an example. And since our last video was on for each loops, I'll create a for each loop for this example. But keep in mind that we can use continue on all three loops, for, while, and for each. So let's go ahead and create a variable and I'll title this VP and since it's a for each loop I need an array so I'll just tie I'll just give it the elements of one two and three I'll close it out now I'll go ahead and create my for each loop so for each parenthesis parentheses curly braces for our statement and in here I'll set our array to our temporary variable and remember we can title this anything we want and I'll just type it I'll just type VP 4L VP for life and in here I'm gonna give it an if statement not an if else statement I'm just gonna give it an if statement I'm gonna give it if and I'm gonna create parentheses and I'm gonna go ahead and create another curly braces I'm gonna drop it down here and in here I want to say if our temporary variable is equal to 2 then I want to pull it out but continue through this loop so we got to type continue to let pH know that we want to pull 2 out of our array but we still want to output 1 and 3 and we don't know why we want to pull 2 out we might want to use it for something else or we just might want to have it out of the array but I don't have a program that's two is going to do anything right now but I'm just trying to give you an example of how continue works so in here I'm gonna drop down a line and I'm still gonna echo our temporary variable VP 4 L and I'm gonna close it out and I'm gonna reload it so if we look through our program that we just created we have a variable with an array that has three elements one two and three that are all integers for each is gonna run through our element or our, our variable and it's gonna use the temporary variable to spit it out but if for if one of our temporary variables is equal to two, it's going to pull it out, but continue with the rest of the array. So this should put output one three, and it's going to look like thirteen, but it's really not. It's just one three right next to each other because I didn't type in a break tag. So let's go ahead and save this and reload it, and it says thirteen. So to make it less confusing, I'll just go ahead and concatenate a break tag right here. And so it should be one on top of a three. Perfect. Okay, so now we know how continue works. It's going to pull something out of a loop, but we're going to continue running that loop. So I hope you guys understand what I'm talking about, and I'll see you guys in the next 